Okie dokie, here we go. Here we go again. No, 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 no. Why it doesn't change? Should be streaming Fallout 76. No, streaming Albion Online. Ah, now it's showing right things. Yes, finally. Everything is good. I hope so. Yep, true. Everything's working now. So, hello and welcome to the Sahib Show and I'll be on online. And today, today we are going Black Zone Gathering. And let's see what's happened there. Uh, I just uh, was in the shop and bought my Blackstone gear so this is like um, 70 let's see it's 90 120 uh, 170 230 200 uh, almost 300k for all this gear so also uh, every time uh, the little tip here if if you go to the black zone Please calculate uh, what you can lose and what you can't. So uh, this 300k is if I take all my crops one day uh, I can cover it. So um, it's not uh, like end of the world if something happens. But uh, also the gear is mm, expensive enough so if something really happens so then, yeah, I don't cry so, so much, <laughs> let's say. Uh, so let's see where, where we should go. How much people there? Only 25 here. Uh, there is trees and... I always like this zone. I don't why, know why this clay hill is very good. It's nice zone. You can fish here. You, uh, I can get uh, metal and wood here. Oh, somebody has been. Okay, always this near this border areas. Uh, people will take take materials there because it's the safest way. Let's not. Uh, I want to say what? <laughs> Forgot. Yeah, attention, these monsters, I want to say. Okay, somebody has been here, truly. Let's see if we have here uh, spells, right? Yep, 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 yep. Let's use omelette. So also, why I'm using this gear? I have played the Albion online now over three and a half years. Oh my God, I have changed these gears like one to another and figured out what works for me and what don't I'm pretty good with uh, monsters but uh, PvP is not not my area <laughs> I can survive I have done that many times mm. but yeah to win PvPs yep done that also but um, I'm not this kind of person so if there is like two also they can two people attacking I think I have to run away fast yes hit me no way 
Let's go to the next zone because next zone there is usually less people there and uh, also really good resources and I don't know but uh, I think this is some uh, America guild or not European time zone because usually there is no guild people there. I don't understand. I think they're sleeping then. And then, and all the always this uh, good idea is. Uh, uh, nope, we missed. Is to go black zone near when the server will restart or after server will restart. So there is less people there. Usually. Oh, look at that. Okay, that was not very friendly guy. He had this uh, poisonous icon there. I should have seen what kind of... Is it clan? Oh, next one! Okay. I think they are... They were gatherers. How come they just run away then? Let's see what kind of clan logo is there now. Ah, red one. And the clan name is... Uh, where's the clan name? Crimson Imperium. Crimson Imperium. Look, so many there okay it's like spider yeah or something no octopus crimson imperium let's see if we see some crimson guys here or they're not all the ordinaries is always there people don't care about them Ah, there is some big guy somewhere here. Oh, look at that. But someone someone has been here because the Runat Runit ore is only two. Uh, two out of five, so there's definitely something going on here. Yep, everything is okay, everything is working. Okay. Let's go and see. Ah, this is taken. So, ah, this is not. So something's going on. And I don't get these because after the server restarts, you get these spatial points. So we have this uh, 60 on leather. Yeah. Okay. Let's upgrade our staff. Yeah, yeah, shoot me, shoot me. Oh, big guy. Oh, I wait this update which coming after um, 21 because then this be pretty, pretty good rewards if you if you find these treasures. Pretty good rewards there. Now it's not so good, but then they are also. Also, when you take these chests, really fun, wonderful things there.
Yeah, now it's so quiet in black zones. Hmm. always to listen what's happening what's really happening hippie will ask what's really happening Where is the old shiny ones? Aha! There is one. Also, oh, this is 50. Not enough points. Okay. Soon we have. Something. Mm, I love this game music. Fantastically done. Yep, next. So, what's what kind of resources you will uh, gather, and uh, do you prefer black zone or do you prefer like uh, red zone gathering? What's your favorite place? Let's have a chat. So empty these black zones these days. Yeah, it's good to be here before the server restarts. Also, after restart is also to pretty. Thank you for following. It's good. Oh, look, big guy. Okay, Uberto. Hello, Uberto. Cursed Mage is good for PvP. Okay. Can you explain a bit why Cursed? What's about cursed? What's what's good about this? I myself am not really good at PvPs. That's why I use plate and this hunter's hood to protect myself and also shield and healing stuff. So basically, this gear is for uh, running away and surviving. Because, yeah, fighting monsters, no problem. Uh, PvP, not so good. What, what's your tactic, this cursed mage? Can you share some information? Uh, have you all uh, already uh, been in this staging server and check out these new updates? What's going on? Oh, we started to get these points right now. Okay, that's good. Because I have been there, I tested out. Uh, I have to test out now that um, 
and there is like if you are uh, if you get attacked even with uh, to the a monster attacks you like I was in the black zone and I, I can't exit black zone where monster attacked me that's new I'm new player I'm looking for a class for myself that's why I asked ah okay Uberto cool uh, why I always read the text is because uh, later uh, some days later these videos are going uh, up to my Sahib show YouTube channel so people then can see the chat so I, I, I read all what you also write there so people understand what I will respond uh, good stuff okay um, okay I, I can give you uh, my opinion thank you for following uh, my opinion is yeah it's it's if, if you are like a very tactical guy uh, or girl and you can um, you can weight the damage because uh, I like this one hand uh, simple girl stuff what was the name let's go here Gerst. so this ordinary this what's to uh, these four charges but uh, you have to weight this damage it's also uh, like plus also a minus uh, the good thing is yeah you do little damage little damage and um, you also keep uh, keep eye what other comp uh, opponent doing and if you get these three charges or four charges thank you for following so then suddenly he gets this uh, big hit and psychology tells that if you are, have less HP you are a little bit afraid so maybe maybe you start like running away or because in this game I understand that if you run away in PvP it's like 80-90% of chance that you will die because if you run then usually you cannot uh, defend yourself so so well and of course you didn't don't attack then so yeah the attacker is always like in a better position I also seen uh, many people using uh, shield also like I'm using when they using uh, girl stuff so to get a little bit better uh, protection because uh, now you can put your points everywhere and put and change them so putting shield 100 and and also both of these shields you can get really good um, damage reduction I will show you tier 6 sarcophagus gives you 5.6% of this defense versus players and mobs if you have these stats there uh, done mm, one second so see plus 13 so it's more than double then that's amazing a 30% damage reduction is really really good also, of course, if you're using, like I used um, cloth care, cloth robe, and uh, then you get much more damage. So yeah, Uberto, uh, for your question, is cursed mage good for PvP? Of course, uh, depends on your playstyle. If you want to be aggressive and... Uh, and you know your tactics I think every gear is good because I have tried so many gears in these three and a half years playing this game and um, my final answer I think uh, which gear is better is there is no bear a better gear or worse gear in the game there is only your choice so you have to figure it out and um, that's the hardest part because you know um, 
if if you are like you have really good reflexes then maybe you should be more aggressive player and uh, and choose the gear that will do uh, like more damage faster when you are uh, little like uh, you want to calculate and take your time and maybe then the girl stuff is uh, also good so you can retreat and go forward what's ah no this is not that person here like uh, he doesn't attack me why because he's not in this area why I know this check the map this is red flag there, this octopus or whatever uh, it is. Yes, Subertu, of course, I am here to help out. A purpose also, if in this Sahib show is a uh, group up uh, like uh, very good players, like good, I mean, like decent players who are willing to talk. Uh, it's here to play for fun and and grow together so that's why I'm doing these shows that uh, so finally we can uh, if you haven't have not good group to play with it's more fun so maybe if someone somebody wants to play sometime I have down uh, in this channel also my discord channel you can add you here there or uh, Add me as a friend in game. We go and play sometimes together. And ask what, whatever questions you have about Albion. I don't know all the answers. Can the same guy, I think. But uh, I can try to help you to see a better picture. Now the question is, is this guy, does he want to attack me or just running around here? What do you think? <laughs> okay, a second. So, Mighty Bombor asks, what is your build? Here, I'm... Uh, tank using healing stuff so this is I'm calling this uh, survival gear so to survive heal myself do a little bit damage and survive so I'm not very good at PvP I can survive and uh, but yeah attacking people this reflexes and everything if the combat is really fast I got confused like oh what and then usually I die <laughs> but this gear is uh, very strong uh, because of my armor and because of healing stuff I can uh, I can stay alive a little bit longer and also because of the healing stuff's attack, 300 is smite. It's to every 1.5 seconds, 300 damage is it's it's really okay. So I can heal myself uh, like every like five or ten seconds, and that's good. Why do you ask, mighty bomber? Seven percent. Have to check how much I can carry. Because if something, let's try here. It's now eighty-four. <laughs> That's good. One percent. I'm shit at PvP too. Oh, funny guy. Okay. So, bomber, what kind of gear you are using? What's your like favorite? Are you more um, 
aggressive guy? Do you find? Do you want to find PVPs or you want to run away? What? Let's go guard there. Ah, okay. This is not that guy. In black zones, it's it's really good to understand uh, what kind of flag is here. So let's see here. There is oh money guild. Yeah, okay. So you see if this is the guild land, so called guild land. It's not guild land. Guild land is already red, but. No, I'm playing like running simulator. Um, okay. <laughs> what's what's running simulator? Um, you have good good sense of humor, but I don't get this running simulator thing. Can you please explain? Oh, another tree. Ah, okay, using heavy set and halberd, okay. So heavy set, um, you mean then the armor? Um, you mean like you're using uh, plate armor? Ah, there was rare there, taken. Hmm, all the items are too taken. Yep, okay. So how's the damage when you use Halberd and you have heavy set? Yeah. Damage okay. Let's take some fishes. Oh, that's good. Does anyone fishing also? Yeah, bleeds are really good. Oh, I, I, I agree. Does anyone uh, fishing and make uh, make money with uh, fishing? Aha! Mighty Bumble says that, but I want to try to make some bow, bow build. So, okay. So, if you're making bow build, are you, um, are you going to use cloth or leather or what do you think? Daily bonus completed. But bro, I'm going to die in one second. What? Why are you dying? Ah, with the uh, skills. Okay. Yeah, but uh, if you are going to the bow, go and use uh, yellow zones for try out there your bow build. Because if you start with bow. Uh, you don't have your skills up, I, I, I guess, if you don't transfer all the skills. Then you can buy like tier 4 bows and go... Um, go and use this uh, yellow zones, there is safe to attack there and if you, if you get knocked off nothing, nothing has lose. Also, very good tip for everyone. Uh, first, uh, when I ask this question, uh, do you use staging server? No, I mean my play skills. Oh, okay. Play skills, we, we can, how say, refine them. 
getting better every day. It's also, uh, I would like to go uh, some adventures together sometimes, so it would be fun. So let's collect like two or three people and let's go together. I like in this game, I love to hunt and find some treasures and, okay. Yeah. Uh, Mighty Bumber about the treasures. I tried, uh, tried out this uh, new update, what's coming in the staging server. So the these treasures and also the treasure chests and this everyday treasure chest they are going gonna be much much more better now much much more better oh so yeah i tried out so that's gonna yeah, improve so now yeah if the update is 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 coming i'm also really interested on on the treasures and uh, everything that's that's good they have changed it a lot a better for better so yeah no ah have, have you any uh, any of you uh, used uh, uh, this staging server what's what's not the live but this test server Say yes if, if you have used this test server and test out things. No one? Oh, a tree. I think I'm almost full also here. Should go back. So few people in the black zones. Let's see here. 97. Good, I'm making like one to two hundred thousand from treasures with like 20, 30 minutes. Holy moly, that's a lot. Really? So much? Wow, I didn't know even this kind of money is possible in so little time. Okay. So, are you... Can I ask? Um, are you um, using black zones to gather your treasures? Or are you using uh, yellow and red zones? Ah, black sounds. Okay. Well, there is some. Did you see? What are you doing? Fighting. Okay. Fight, fight. I will take this tree. So what tier, um, what tier equi equipment you use when you go to the black zone, mighty bumble? Four. Okay. So you use just tier 4 or 4.12, is it in a change, uh, uh, what's the word? <laughs> Enchanted or what, I uh, can't pronounce it right now. Oop. Ah, also you here. You don't want to attack me, you are tier 4 horse. I think you are just for fun here. 
Oh, a treasure. Now we have to go home because otherwise we are slowed down too much. So maybe I should also come back and make this treasure mm, treasure run. Mighty Bumble says, when I started to play this game, I didn't know that you will lose all items when die, so I died in tier 6 set and that was not good. So now I'm playing like Gypsy. Okay. Yep. That's the fun and sad part in this game. That if you do, if you, if you, uh, if you kill somebody yourself, it's very fun, very good to get other people items if you are winning, but very sad if you lose them, if you have, yeah. That is true. Okay, let's sell these things there. But this treasure, treasure thing, 200k for 20-30 minutes, that's, that's fantastic. Octopuses, fishes, I don't sell my things here right now. I always refine new. And then. I, I haven't tried out this. Um, uh, what's called this faction thing where, where you get this faction uh, transfer quests. So have anyone tried these faction transfer quests when you get these items and have to transfer one city to another? Mighty Bomber says that tier 5 treasures is so good, like 5 to 25 thousands. True. That's so true. So, um, in treasures, have uh, have you found some uh, items also? I mean, not in the chests, but these treasures, what's in the woods or in the in the areas? Okay, so today there is no. No restart. That's strange. Hmm, because should be daily maintenance, but there is not. What's going on? Maybe we should go back then. Do this treasure round. Let's see. Yep, uh, Mighty Bomber says that usually tier 4 items and tomes of insight, but most items uh, was tomes of insight. They change maintenance time. Really? Whoa, I didn't know that. Uh, what's the maintenance time now then? Okay, we have to go to the forums later to see what's the... 
What's the new maintains time then? So, uh, are you playing right now? Mighty or not? find these treasures let's see if we can find some new what some guy there Treasures, where are you? Let's go to the next map. Maybe there is less people there. Also, I can check out one thing. Let's see now. You come here. Attack me, please. Attack me. Hit me. Hit again. Hit more, one more smile. Time. Ah, I can go to the another zone. So because the next update, what's coming? Uh, I write that if you get attacked, you can't leave the black uh, zone. It's like game says that says that uh, you can't leave the zone while attacked or something. I don't want to ride with you. Ride yourself. So... So yeah, that's new. So... I tried it only once, I have to try it again, but... I think in the new, uh, new version of the update, you can't leave the black zone if you get attacked, so... So yeah. Have to know... Be that in mind, because... It's really crucial information if you want to stay alive. Okay. Oh, there may be some chest nearby, is there? Ah, there is next chest there. Let's see if the chest is there. Let's see if we are lucky or then not. I thought I saw something there. Okay. Ah, you still noticed me, okie dokie. Oh, look at that. Have to take it. What kind of zone guild is here? Aha! Uh -huh. Money guild, yep. What do you do for a living? I am do a little bit of the sales and uh, write books, learn to understand myself and the spiritual thing. And uh, now I want to uh, concentrate on the computer game industry and and such I have do uh, done some businesses in my life have been uh, different work, working different IT companies in the past but now I understood that um, life is little bit more than what you have to do uh, you have to enjoy life so do what you really like. So I really like computer games. I really like computer games. So I play computer games. And I do occasional projects and jobs. 
help people out using psychology, my sales knowledge. So these chests are taken. Thank you, Bomber. Mighty Bomber says that's yes, I agree. Okay, this chest was taken. Is there some other chest? Ah, there is this big one. No. So let's 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 try to find treasures. Yeah, in uh, uh, I live a little country, Estonia. It's near the between the Russia and Finland. So there was this uh, event called Hypertown. This is like a gaming and comic con event, but it's like really small <laughs> because it's only in these th uh, three. Uh, little countries, Estonia, Latvia and Lithuania, so so I was impressed, it's, it's, it was cool different world, like um, yeah, I liked it so now I want to go and, oh, tier 7 ok, I can't gather that yet I want to go uh, some bigger these kind of events in future how strong are you? Eight thousand. But th that's sad. If, if you if you kill this big monster, you don't get any good stuff out of it. Usually. So yeah, I, I like this uh, this kind of events. People there and this friendliness and uh, like new world for me. Check this zone. Whoop. How are, ah, only one people. So you want to fight? Or do you want to what? Are you following me? No. Yes, maybe. So where where should we find treasures? Oh, there is one treasure there. It's not ordinary, but works for me. Yes, yeah, sad that this six point two rune, this ore is not worth so much. 5.2 is more expensive, much more. So yeah. So what uh, what kind of other games people are playing? What's uh, what's your like favorite? Uh, myself, I'm playing. Uh, I really like this Fallout 76. What's what's new now? And um, also, I like uh, this online MMORPGs. My uh, the game what I'm really really looking about, looking forward. It's the right word, yeah. Is Chronicles of Elyria. I don't know if anyone have heard of that, but that's I think it's completely changing the online game industry, like completely. They have uh, developed it, I think, over two, maybe over three years now. And so we can hope, hope that maybe next year it's going out this beta version. Aha, okay. Uh, Cherry R1N. 
<laughs> okay, let's just cherry. And write that link, that game you were talking about, a web page or something, okay? Let's see here. Let's hope that I stay alive. <laughs> there you go. Um, there is also uh, the good thing is the people, the person, the staff is doing these videos every month or over uh, or every two months. But um, uh, I, I suggest that you check out YouTube. Uh, and uh, and find this chronicles of Eluria like review videos or what what will explain this game like in uh, seven or ten minutes. So there is like um, so much to understand, even too much. Uh, but um, but the idea and concept is 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 really strong. Because there is like uh, where you born, like here if you see the map there is different biomes, there is swamp and green area and snow area and, no sorry this is swamp yeah, and uh, desert. So in Chronicles of Elyria if you, um, if you are here born at the snow area you have one abilities if you are here another and the tall people small people uh, white uh, little bit like uh, narrow and bigger people it depends where you start if you die there is a permadeath even you can then you you can't go forward anymore and uh, everything is of course player made even houses but yeah, there is so much, so much, and crafting and systems and people can do their own potions, things. <laughs> that's that's so so crazy. But but yeah, step by step, if if you're really into this kind of games, uh, check it out. So Mighty Bomber talks that uh, I'm not big gamer. I spend like two uh, two hours, plus minus two hours to play Albion and. Now it's just my only one game, but I play it uh, World of Warcraft, Lineage 2, uh, Leech of Legends, I think the lol is, and so on. But I am always solo player because I like feel like I'm freelancer, to do what I want alone, not like with guild or something. Okay, you're like me. <laughs> I'm also mostly I am alone, but now I. I have been like year or more, a little bit more. I have seeking people to play with, uh, not all the time, but that uh, should there be like good community. So if you if you like, uh, if the feeling tells you, oh no, I like party, so then you have this community or Discord community or somewhere where the players are, where you can see what game player uh, is playing or something and and you can ask okay I'm going like play Albion I want to do like black zone gathering or black zone chest or what can anyone come or interested so some come some not so that's that's the good thing oh treasure that's that what that's why I'm doing these videos so we can like create a uh, good community and we have major and friendly players to play with. Uh, <laughs> Mighty Bomber says that also I like to create some retarded Albion builds and try them. Yes. Uh, and I think most people want because they have a chance now. <laughs> and also Mighty Bomber it says that I want to try to create a rube tank. Okay, <laughs> that's interesting. That's like uh, really interesting. 
Okay. Yes. Um, you took my words. <laughs> I like what? <laughs> That's cool. A rope tank. Imagine that. These two words, like in mind, they don't go together. It's like uh, here, like error. Z -z -z -z. Rope tank don't go together. <laughs> See? Yes. <laughs> yes, I see. <laughs> it's like it's like also uh, if you uh, how how to compare it? Yeah, I say retarded mighty bomber says. Yeah, but it's uh, like in good way retarded. It's it's good. So in like uh, many 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 maybe t 20 30 years back and somebody says flying car people are like no flying and car going to, don't go together, but now there it is. There is flying cars. They even sell them now. So yeah, maybe there is a rope tank, but you have to find the way. It it would be fun because yeah, imagine how much how much damage you can make and uh, stay alive. Wow, fantastic. Yeah, okay. Mighty Bomber says that will be. I promise. That's a strong promise, Saka. But yeah, <laughs> I like this promise. So, I think uh, one thing what, what you really need is this. If you want to build Rube tank. Because, um, I will explain. Defense versus players and mobs even tier 6 plane shield, which is only like uh, 50,000 or something. One second. There was player. No, I don't want you here. What do you want to do now? Do you want to attack me? No, you just wanted to check me out. Okay. Uh, I want to show you. I'm a, I don't know if I showed you, but uh, yeah. Uh, nope, not that area. This is Hill of Hollow Earth. Cherry asks, I am in a stone stop, ain't ya? Um, I don't know, this is Hill of Hollow Earth. But uh, for the mighty, see there is, defense is 8.5%. But if you have your shields, which is which take so, so less these points, both 100 here. So then it's 13. Now it should be more. Okay, 13, but they go up, 13% is really, really good, and you don't have to take your robe off, it's good. So I just, I suggest, good shield. Look like stones of haha with all those maze areas. Ah, Jerry talks that, yeah, it looks like stone stop. Okay, where is this stone stop, by the way? I don't even know. Okay, let's go to the next area. Where is this big guy lies? Maybe there is some some treasures there. Cherry, question for you. Um, do you know what time now this server restart is? Because um, Mighty said that uh, they have changed it. What time? Oh, this is tier 4, I think. Yep. Stay, please. Mm. Mighty says, Yes, you can take shield and one hand sword gives 20 perception. Percent damage reduction for 5, 6. Uh -huh. oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. 
I think there is that kind of spell, yeah? Oh, look at that. Nope. That was fast. <laughs> Whoa! Two guys there. Uh, I better run away. Just... To stay alive. Tier 6.1 I need that Look, I am attacking very slowly Only 275 But he does me How much? 32 damage Attack my put shield up 13 it's like, what the hell are you doing? <laughs> That's why I like this plate and shield, so this damage is really like nothing. Ding, heal. But what kind of other games you like? Is there some uh, new games maybe? You have tried? There is one. Uh, what was the game? I bought it like a month ago. Haven't haven't played more than one time because it was like so alpha, so alpha. I have to remember the name. One second. Uh, ah, remembered. Oh, next one. Uh, it was Grand Screa Online. Do, do you know that game? Have, have you ever anyone played that? Tried it out? Yeah, Blade is not good word. Tried it out is better. I think. Grand Screa Online. Never, I don't know, never had a chance to check these kind of chests. I wonder what's in, inside there. Maybe, maybe we should uh, gather up some people, like 10 or, ten or so, and uh, go all together in the staging server, this beta test server in Albion, and go this kind of area, take down these monsters, what's there, and, and just to check what kind of stuff these chests will bring, give, give us. That would be cool. Because, yeah, you have to be in be killed or something to, to get it in, in, in live servers, I think. Maybe I'm wrong? I don't know. Sixty-six I have I can't uh, take much things so let's what where is this exit here hmm where should I go right right oh okay so so far 
What about here? No. I'm checking map now. One, two, three, four, five, six maps. Really? Six maps. Okay. Look, there was a rare one. Oh. Fantastic. So when the next will go up? Uh, 20 seconds. So this is Friday. I think. So how do you like um, how do you like this lizard daily this uh, challenge reward bonus pest lizard have you tried it and how do you like it Treasures. Hello, where's all the treasures? Ah, thank you very much. No, 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 why I didn't did that? Okay. Move, right now. Thank you very much. Oh, let's take only these because I have to take everyone. So people we don't know, but I, I have to throw these away, otherwise I can't take these expensive ones. Ah, let's throw them all away. Let's take only five and sixes. Oh, check it out, there was wow, wow, we wow. 6.3 Rhino there, that's good Some was, Someone was lucky Really lucky I don't even remember when I got point threes. So maybe how often you get point three resources? Once a um, week, once a month, once a year. Oh, next one, really? Wow. That's amazing. I have to check first where do I have to go up and okay, first up and then let's see oh, there is someone what he is doing there almost dead Hmm. I think he was fighting. Maybe I should be bad and go and kill him. He has so few like lives uh, HP left. Let's say like that. Uh, okay. Mighty asks that. Do you gonna sell your stones and leather or are you gonna make something from it? No, now I don't um, I don't make anything uh, but uh, yep yeah, I sell but first I refine uh, I don't sell any 
uh, raw materials just like that always I am refining them and then I'm selling materials so yeah, now, now I don't uh, oh hello wolf do you want to give me a white pop please oh that would be very nice yeah you can do this damage if you want why you ask my dear How much money do you gonna get? Hmm, plus minus. Uh, when when my bag is full, um, depends. If there is only this 6.1s and 5.1, if I sold just for materials, I think 100,000 or something. When I refine it, maybe a little bit more. Maybe 150 or something, if I uh, also have to calculate this, that also previous materials. But if, if you refine, you get 30% uh, uh, back, even if you don't use your crafting focus, if you refine it in the right city. So, haven't done it yet, but I'm collecting now all the materials to do it. I have like, when I started this game, when I started in the, this uh, was, uh, what was, second alpha, when Albion just was thinking, was st starting or something, then all the alphas and all the betas, what was there, uh, I did bunch of business all the time trading making bags making uh, these what's this capes yeah forgot the name <laughs> so yeah uh, there was really really big money to make uh, but uh, then in this game i started and uh, yeah little bit I made money not so much usually I'm just picking up my daily crops and I will make like 200 and ah oh, damn it oh, thanks my shield save and that will make me like 280 thousand every every day that's almost my only income now so because i'm i'm not playing um uh, like more than half an hour maybe hour a day but yeah i don't know after the update maybe i will play a little bit more or if there is some cool people to play with or purposes change <laughs> i don't know if they make more solo player content like they have also uh, told so maybe yeah in future I will play more Albion but yeah there is so much so much content to the guilds and group people and so little for us solo players I don't know when but I hope that in some day game developers uh, understand that 85 to 90 percent all of the players in whole wild world is solo players even if they are in the guild even if they are on the groups most time plays in solo oh there is some guy are you coming to attack me or what are you doing or just running away so yeah because if you see the Albion, it's sad to say, but yes, so much per people are gone. And who, who, who are these people? They are solo players. No, 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 take this, come on. 
You have money there and you don't take it. Why not? So let's hope that the we, uh, developers make more solo content. I have also written in the forums and everything. But if there is more people who will ask solo content, maybe there will be in near future. But what do you think about solo player content? How much importance this is for you? Let me know. School map haven't been I think I haven't been here but I am not sure so that brute Glen really cool name oh money guild is so where I have to go right down left okay. let's go then I thought about uh, if you uh, if we talking about um, crafting to make capes start from scratch. But I don't know yet. So Mighty Bomber uh, writes that uh, for me it's so important. But yep, they say it will be more content for solo players. So I hope it will. Yes, let's hope. Because they, they are talking about this uh, West Sand and things and it was, would be fun. Would be fun. I don't even know how they how they get back their players because when the game started is there anyone before I, I, I wrote it, is there anyone who, whoa, the rare one, I want you. Come on, I don't want you now. Is there anyone here who, uh, who, who was when the server starts? Was this June 2017 or what? I want like uh, Mighty says that I want like mini bosses with good loot because now rare mobs is not really good. Yep. They yeah there is but there in the new update there should be this new bosses I think loot wise yep oh so many Yeah, it would be fun if there is like um, mm, some kind of uh, solo solo monsters, big, like I don't know, twenty thousand HP or something. Or if you take it down, it's like uh, really high chance to get good good stuff out of it. It would be really nice. Where I wanted to go. Okay. But okay, uh, when when the game started, okay, I understand the first days that it was insanely overpopulated. But then uh, later, 
there is like uh, in Carleon, there was always 300 to 500 people and other cities always like 100 to 200. So it was like really fun. Now there is in Carleon, there is like 100 to 200 and other people's cities 20, 30 up to 100. So yeah, so much. Where are you people? Mighty says, do you know any other languages like not English and Estonian? I speak uh, Finnish and uh, I understand Russian and I also speak Russian but uh, uh, not very well. <laughs> I have learned in school like 12 years Russian but yeah I don't have any practice many years so yeah it takes time to understand that I have every I have these words and understanding so it's like um, maybe 50% 60% understanding and how to express myself yeah four languages then Oh, that kind of saber doof from ten. Um, Mighty says, but I know few Russian Russian words, but I think they're not <laughs> not really nice. Usually, yes, people um, people be, uh, usually get these first uh, these words first. This really not li not really nice words. Also, yeah, uh, yes, there is some words also in Sweden, uh, I also know it's not really nice, but yeah. That's the fun part of the languages, that's the interesting part you first learn, <laughs> and then other words come. Yeah. So now here, to the right, so northeast, let's... Let's go middle of the map and then right. So it's more fun. I like the game music. Have you, uh, have any one of you seen the video? about Albion Online made by the development team what uh, will uh, show how they did the game this background music it's so awesome if you haven't seen it go and check it out that's that usually blows your mind it's like wow because yeah, whole orchestra behind it. Hmm, there's also a, oh, that kind of guy there. I don't want to meet you. Okay. Hello. Was wearing mage robe there. Now I can take because so near with this. What's the what's called this teleportation thing? Oh, <laughs> portal. Yes, word. Portal. Okay, let's check near areas here. Okay, right now come here. I will. Ah, there is so many of you. So I need only one. So yeah. Oh, you don't attack me, another rhino. Okay. 
That's fine with me. So someone has taken this. This here. Ah, it's but is full. Five out of five. That's good. Amazing. So, Mighty, where are you from? Okay, let's go now back. Uh, Mighty says that I think if they gonna make it free to play there will be a lot of people but I don't think that it's worth it. Yep, I will totally agree with you. Usually free to play games uh, people just come and like try them out they don't um, they don't look deeper or deep, deep, deep deeper or something. And also, if you check out this, uh, check out this price. This is only 30 euros. It's not like end of the world. And if you don't want to pay these 30 euros, you have to, you have a choice to take this seven-day trial, which is like, it's like, it's like best thing what you can give new people. Imagine if in every game there has like seven day trial for free fantastic or even in, in the small fee let's say 10 percent of the game price so let's say i very like very much like fallout 76 so i bought it but uh, if there was like a trial period and i'm not very sure then i gladly paid this four or five euros to try it out for seven days and then to do uh, this upgrade. So I think in Albion they have done this marketing thing very well because of this trial key and also if you uh, are using this referral program that you get money out of it, game money I mean. That's, that's good. Every game should have this because if, if you really like the game and and because your friends and uh, and who who, uh, who play games will like they listen your advice, it's higher chance that you get a decent people to the game because they you have the chance to uh, explain the game and and uh, why do you why you like it and that that's important. So marketing thing in this game is fantastico, very well done. I think, that's my opinion. Oh, I have these also. Or what's, what's your opinion about this game marketing side? Yeah, some. Yeah, I have already made one hundred twenty thousand. Imagine that, just for selling these this treasure chest thingies. Now I have to put these here in my chest. Sorry for that. I need water. Hmm. Water is so good. 
Mighty Bomber says that I am from Mongolia. Wow, really? That's cool. That's wonderful. So, your first one from Mongolia who like uh, I have talked to. So, cool. That's that's really something. Oh. Then Chu you have difficult names, sorry for that. Chu Tse Durak. Durak. Let's say Chu, can I say Chu? Chu says that I'm from Brazil. Okay. Nice, so a warm country. That's wonderful. What's the temperature temperature there now? In Brazil. And what's temperature in uh, Mongolia right now? Like outside, how many degrees Celsius, let's say. Thank you for following. Fantastic. So what time I can get my... Ah, I can take my crops. Okay, I have to do that. Because then tomorrow I can do it earlier. Where is my... Ah, here. This thing here. Uh, Joe says in south winter is about 0 to 15 Celsius and summer 25 to 40. Okay, cool. It's like winters are uh, warmer than here, yeah. Our winters here is like minus 10 to minus 30. Now is summer 30, 30 Celsius than in Brazil. Okay, so imagine that. Fantastic weather. Ah, you lucky ones there. <laughs> I, I also like when it's warm and you can go to the swim. Oh yeah. That's fantastic. So, um, question for you uh, who, are, who are watching. Uh, what, uh, what are you growing on your islands? And what do you do? with your crops are you uh, just taking it up or are you um, making some soup or some other edibles out of them or potions or what do you do on your islands i will tell my uh, my idea i i will grow this only for this dragon diesel I, I was growing these cabbages and make cabbage soup, but this market wasn't um, so good, so I changed. <laughs> okay, cool. Uh, Joe says that nothing, I don't have patience for that. Okay. Yeah, it it uh, but a uh, good thing too is that it takes only um, if you have like I have one account where is three character every character has one island and the islands are almost full. That it takes maximum ten minutes of your time every day, and you can yeah if twenty two hundred thousand is easy for you that's no bother don't bother. I spent my focus points refining, okay. And Mighty says playing blackjack with hookers. Uh, okay, right now, Mighty, right now you are play playing blackjack with hookers. Really? That's cool. <laughs> okay, Absol, thank you for the information. Please talk in English so everyone can understand. Not only me. So yeah. Uh, I changed my 
growing habits. I was uh, growing cabbages and um, I maxed out this and <laughs> thank you very much this was English uh, so yeah but the soup making um, and the refine points going there it, it wasn't so good this dragon diesel cost like uh, 285 to 310 per one dragon diesel soup sorry cabbage costs like um, 900 sorry 170 to 210 and if you made soup out of it some sometimes you even lose them so that's why I did huge turn why I am saying huge turn because um, to start a new thing to grow it costs you a couple of millions even because the seeds you buy first and you, it doesn't uh, first 50 points you don't have it, it's no no sense to put your crafting focus here also I refined then but now I put crafting here because now I saving money that way. So uh, I don't have to buy um, extra seeds every day. If I had to buy, it's maybe costing me like uh, 150k every day. So I would earn only 100k a day. Now I'm earning also almost 300,000 every day just for growing these dragon diesel diesel yeah? So it's good for me. I tried also this uh, what's called one second this uh, special omelets. First it was really profitable, but then something happened in the market and I had like four was maybe four thousand of these omelets like four or five million worth so yeah it was I, I was selling them almost two months then because I don't want to give away give away them so so little price so yeah what was that I was I was making these Try brew crab omelette. So I did everything myself. Uh, I the goose get me eggs and diesel, and I had cabbages. Only I buy these dry brew crabs. So it's like one thousand three hundred uh, one. But still, yeah, wasn't for me. So how about um, so how about your islands? Do you decorate your island like me, or would you leave your island just like it is? What you do? What are you doing with your islands? Question. It's so quiet at night. Even no one is talking there. But this cloth mage still is like bothering me. <laughs> I should go to the staging server and try, the, try there out this build just for fun. 
I don't change my build here because I, 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 I so much love it now, but I want to check the cloth mate. Cloth tank should be fun. Is there anyone who want to also tell the, tell me or others also uh, 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 about their build, what they're using, why they're using, what they think is the best or uh, why they're thinking this is the best solution for what kind of whoop, wrong button, what kind of inventory they have. Also, uh, what's your, uh, who is your, what, yeah, who is your, <laughs> who is your favorite YouTuber or uh, who is your favorite um, Twitch streamer? So I can also see what kind of channels are you maybe looking, maybe I am also interesting. My build, uh, Chu says, my build is knight helmet, soldier chest, assassin boots, carrion collar. Okay. Uh -huh. So you look like, you, you look like um, it's, it's very good build for this um, group playing. But you are half tank and also you do damage. But I don't understand this carry and caller. I I have tried it, but um, I haven't sold the idea yet. So can you explain what's good about carry and caller? What you like best? What why you are interested in the carrier caller? What's your tactics about this? Okay, so this island almost done. Uh, Joe says, mm, damage over time and heal the buff. Aha, uh -huh. okay, so Carrion Gawler have heal the buff some kind. Okay, uh, let me see one second. I will do this field and I'm interested to understand what's this heal the buff about. Only one island to go. I also don't like this or have not no really patience for this boring thing. This um, islands, but but I so my so much like this three hundred thousand every day. So ah, I will do it. <laughs> so carry on caller is an axe. I presume, yep. Yes, I was right. Uh, let's take tier six. So, mm, okay, damage over time is that bleeding? I understand that. Uh, also, this is bleeding. Sent, uh, transcendent Raven straight line dealing 348, sorry, 48 physical damage to all enemies hit. Additionally, it causes targets to bleed. Oh, it's now three bleeds. Oh, that's good. Over the duration that bleed, the targets received healing is reduced by 35%. Okay. That's much. But so that's. That's five seconds then this minus thirty five percent I I I assume, yep. 
W and D. Yeah, of course. Q, W and D. What's here? Normal increased defense. Every five normal attacks or resistance are increased by... Whoa! 86! That's bad. Only two seconds, but 86 is <laughs> really much. Oh, life leech. Every normal attack you restore 11 health. That's also good. So, yeah. So that's it's good weapon to take down healers like me. <laughs> I assume. Mm, okay, let's see our third iron. So also there is one field where I grow these ones. What these called? Gooses. See one, two, three, four, five, six. Six little ones, yep. One, two, three, four, five, six. I have to buy three. Missing three. No, it was three. Uh, why I'm doing that here, growing these gooses, because this is the cheapest way for my understanding to get my animal breeder to 100. So I have seven points to go. And that's only... Only this... Book book reason why book book I will do it. Yep. Uh, I hope that someday I will get this white tire with pop so I can grow it myself. And then of course sell it. I don't need seventy million <laughs> worth of this mount really what what mount I really would like is this one of these lizards or then this big mammoth is, who is like like attacking and uh, sorry this defense mammoth this I think the lizard is easier to go with because he has 9000 HP and almost no chance they can take me off if I'm on the mount so what kind of mount do you like in this game what what what's your dream mount my dream mount is where is my where is mount Uh, where is this? This flame basilisk. Or, if really I have luck, then this elder common mammoth. Because I'm, I can go and uh, gather and stay alive even if there is like 10 people ganking me. Just walking through zones to home. Goodbye, I'm going home now. What's your favorite mount in Albion Online? Like, what do you really want to use? If there is like money and everything, so you could buy it and use it. Good sound. Drum. Like, oh yes, you're so successful. Thank you very much. Ah, no. No. One field to go, then this boring job today is over. Thank 
you very much then. Went almost pretty well today. I have, have not lost very much seeds. So today it was pretty good day. Some days I end up with only left like three or four seed packs. But today is good day. Seed return is wonderful, I say. Amazing even. One more, yeah? That's it. Yes. 11 packs. Imagine that. Good day. That was good day. And see, 994. Only 6 is missing. From the thousand, so yet, yes, it's good day. Let's put our things away. Oh, okay. When we are in the Corleone, let's see the market. How much? How much is the market price? In the, this dragon season. So, how much? <gasps> wow, price is so low. What's going on? I want 285. And I have 30 days to sell it, so take your time. <laughs> Definitely, I don't sell it for cheaper. I will show you. My island and then I have to go and eat otherwise how do I survive so here I built the camp and there is some statues if someone is bad it's going there in the gauges you can eat here if you don't like this guy you can make your food here and here is this fields. This is my house. There is, uh, I don't know whose clothes are this. Maybe I have a secret wife who, who I don't any idea who it is, he is, she is. <laughs> There's some trees. You can, you can decorate the things. This is like almost out of order, but still you can use the bridge. This is my like meditation place. So, oh, everything is so calm. Okay, there you can. This is trees. You can see like you are almost in the na uh, in nature. This is some strange place. I don't know what's what, what's that's there. So here is two strange places. And a sword. <laughs> That's it. Okay, then. Uh, oh, cool name. Yassa Brasa. Yassa Brasa. Hello, Yassa Brasa. Yassa is uh, asking why do you use cloth, plate, and leather on this space with healing stuff and he smiles oh so um, I have tried so many builds in this I played now three and a half years and um, and yes I am uh, saying that I am not very good at PvP so this is my stay alive build, <laughs> if I can say so. 
The point is that if you have high enough armor and this shield, shield is wonderful, it gives 13% defense versus play, player and uh, healing, so I can heal myself 244 or 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 600 almost. Usually, oh, sorry. Usually I use tier 8 gear, so this is tier 6, this is tier 8, these boots I use because uh, I haven't seen any boots in this game what's better than Skinner work boots. Why? Check it out. That's fantastic to run away. There is uh, increase your move speed by 70% 10 seconds, but the Bonus is that any creatures will stop attacking you, including on, on other territory guards. So if I, if I am um, like three people are attacking me and I running through the mobs camp using this, mobs attacks other people, but not me. But only the minus side downside is this five seconds. I can't use my spells. That's only only bad thing but otherwise yeah I will use this to decrease 60% of damage then four second I will reflect them damage and then I can heal so this is runaway uh, <laughs> uh, build so yeah uh, Yasa says looks nice dude I love when people do their own build that's how you learn the game thank you very much Yasa yeah uh, my previous build was strong healer, but um, I have tried once similar build with with knight knight armor uh, because of this wind wall and and uh, and it was good. Uh, Yasa says that playing with blue armor by myself only uh, Z Z ZVZs build Zerg versus Zerg is this yeah playing with blue armor by myself only Zerg versus Zerg builds okay uh, this yeah uh, I have been in big guild in this game uh, was KDS I don't know if this guild exists or uh, how it's going for them but this guild was like um, good very 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 organized I loved it, this organization, uh, mechanics, and how they learn, uh, teach people and their different groups. But it was like too military-like. And that's why uh, I was there over two years, maybe. So yeah, now, I, I was playing alone and oh, most of the time playing, but now I'm this void core, little guild. We had our island, but no, now it's also, uh, I don't know, <laughs> not so good anymore. Uh, Wasa says that the game is epic, so much to do. Yep, I totally agree. There is so much to do. But it's nice if you have uh, friends in these games who, can, who you can play with sometimes. Because I am uh, also like mighty, I am most of the time solo player. But sometimes I really want to go like uh, adventure. So it would be nice like two or three people together going to the black zones or treasures or taking some um, chests or, or going to fight or something like that. So that's also why, why I'm uh, streaming, I'm doing YouTube videos. So my little dream is to build this community with uh, friendly and major players who, who is like uh, good just to hang out, play, have fun and sometimes uh, play together. But this build this good community and, and uh, that's, that's why I'm streaming. 
so yes but now uh, I have to go and eat because I have played how many hours two two or three already but yeah if uh, if you liked and you want to see uh, and be part of another streams and videos please follow also you can scroll down and check my YouTube channel and and uh, also there is discord where you can uh, add yourself so we can connect so I have uh, I'm going um, going to be uh, live again today uh, let's say after two hours two and a half so yeah I will put this on the town down in this counter so I'm playing uh, Fallout 76 this is a good game I'm just knowing uh, knowing this and testing it out but yeah thank you everyone for watching and I hope to see you on the next live goodbye see you again